Hi there, my name is Nelly M, and today we're playing Potion Permit. Welcome back, everybody. I hope you're having a great day. Um, we're picking up right where we left off, and we are going to go ahead and just figure out what, uh, hopefully figure out maybe why, or not why, but how to unlock Martha's next friendship level. I don't know, we'll figure it out. Who knows? Who knows what we'll get up to today? But apparently not making potions, well, or, well. Oh, hey, <laughs> I think we might have just figured it out. <laughs> Hello, Yam. Hi, Martha. I was just passing by and wanted to give you these moon cloves. Oh, thanks. That's a nice gift. Huh? <laughs> but why, Martha? Huh? Why do you look so confused? Oh, you, you didn't know about our gift-giving tradition? I do, but let's pretend I don't. Ah! Uh. <laughs> ah! Since you're new to Moonbury, I thought I'd share something with you. Okay. Moon cloves are a symbol of friendship. They're a Moonbury specialty. People love receiving them as presents. Okay, do they? <laughs> we give moon cloves to our friends to strengthen the bonds between us. Cool. Why don't you try it? Is there anyone you like? As a friend, I mean. I... I hope we can all be friends. We can, Martha. See you around, Yem. Uh-huh. <laughs> nice. The kind-hearted chemist. Moon cloves unlocked. Well, okay, debatable. Befriend villagers. Okay, I certainly will. Tell me more about it. Uh, Martha reminds Yam about the tradition of friendships on Moonbury Island. She suggests that Yam should befriend some of the villagers. Befriend villagers. So maybe it's not that each character has their thing locked. Maybe it's just that uh, the the I had to do this before we could unlock a second level of friendship, perhaps. Uh, let's see. Where's Martha? Is she still upstairs? She's not. Okay, good to know. So she heads out and does not go immediately to work necessarily. Oh, I guess the Lazy Bull Tavern does not open until noon. So, 10. <laughs> does not open until 10. So Martha clearly has her mornings available to her. Where might she go? Over here somewhere? This is where I found her in the past. Uh, let me read your fortune this week. Uh, but I don't believe in that kind of stuff, Helene. <laughs> but I believe some good fortune will be coming your way soon. Oh, uh, really? Oh, okay. Tell me more about it. <laughs> uh huh. Hi, Zeke. Chemist, do you like cats? You'd better. <laughs> okay. Tremendous. Do I have moon cloves? I I should, right? I have one. How am I supposed to befriend three villagers with only one moon clove? Perseverance, I guess. Who's this again? I can't remember. Mercy! You're that new chemist, right? Hope you can get used to living in this town. I'm sure I can. And please don't compare it to your capital. I... won't. Question mark? Alright, where's Martha? Gotta figure this system out. I'm curious just to talk to Martha, because theoretically she's at the highest level of, you know, like level one friendship. So theoretically just a chat with her would take it to level two, if that is unlocked. Otherwise, I don't know what the next step is. Uh, the arcade center. It's after 10 and no one is working. Okay. I guess opens at 10 is is sort of a just sort of a generalization. It opens 10ish. Hello. Obel Hearts house. <laughs> Where do you find people? 
How do I find all the characters I want to talk to? There's Russo. I don't even want to talk to you, Russo, but how's it going? What are you looking at? I didn't do anything. <laughs> Good talk, Russo. I'm not giving you moon cloves just yet. Sure, I will at some point. Oh! Oh, a cutscene! There's Martha! Do you want me to try your cookies? <laughs> you, you want me to try your cookies? Go on, take as many as you like. Let's have a taste, shall we? Uh, well, how do they taste? No, oh, Martha. Uh, fantastic! Uh, um, they, they smell wonderful, and uh, the flavor's completely unique. Ah. <laughs> you want to take some more with you? Y yes, I'll share some with Derek. He'll be thrilled. <laughs> ah, uh, I've, I've got to go. I've got an appointment thing. G -g Good luck with your cookies. Uh. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll have some of your cookies, Martha. Huh? Hi, Yam. I made some cookies this morning. Cool. Want to give them a try? Uh-huh. <laughs> Didn't even give me the option. Of course I do. Mm. <laughs> oh, what's the matter? Is there something wrong with them? <gasps> May I, I try a little bit? You, do you not have more? Did I take all your cookies? Or you want to try this one? Just in case it's just this one that's bad. Mm. <laughs> You're right. It tastes funny. <laughs> yeah. Do you use salt instead of sugar? <laughs> I think I accidentally added garlic instead of ginger. What would that do? If you were trying to make like gingerbread cookies or ginger cookies, what would happen if you added garlic instead of ginger? I wonder if they would really be truly terrible, or... I don't know. <laughs> Silly me. I'm sorry. If I'd realized earlier, I wouldn't have let you try them. Uh. <laughs> don't worry about it, Martha. Uh, thank you for being so honest, Yam. Being frank with other people takes a lot of courage. I'll try not to be so absent-minded next time. Thumbs up! I'll finish the rest of the cookies at home by myself. <laughs> you could just... not. <laughs> huh? Well, um... If I made another batch of cookies, would you like to try them? Absolutely! Nice! Hey, don't be scared of them next time, okay? <laughs> I'll promise they'll be better. Just... Just try them before you start handing them out. That's that's probably all you need to do. Quest completed, knowing more. Wait, what? Oh, friendship level up. Yeah, all right. So it, I think it is a cutscene. You get a... Wait, what was that? <laughs> what did I complete? I didn't have a quest. <laughs> knowing more. Why did it say knowing more? Where's my, like, is there a past quests? I don't understand. Whatever. Whatever it was, I completed it. And now Martha has, I've leveled up and I've befriended one villager. So clearly that is how we do it. But now where's Martha? <laughs> I still want to talk to Martha more. I don't know if I'll give her the moon cloves just yet because I would like to do this quest. All right, nobody works here. <laughs> the schedules of these people is wild. Let's go get some moon cloves to Otmar. I like Otmar. Maybe we can get Otmar to be a friend.
I doubt I'll get there with one with one set of moon clubs, but you never know. This is not the right way. Hi, Mercy. Oh wait, before we do that, let's go to the church and see if we can, can't make a little extra cash. Stomping grapes. Do you want to help grind grapes at the church? I sure do. Takes two hours. Grind ten sacks of grapes. I will. Go! 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 Tremendous. <laughs> Yay! 125 gold. Alright. What? Okay. Oh, dog, how you doing? Hey, go, pet, pet. And let's give you a snack. Still have more mushrooms than honey, so you can have another one of those. There you go. Can I give you moon cloves? Oh, I can't. What do you mean? What is this? Oh, find NPC? What? Oh, dude. <laughs> that rules. Okay, never mind. I was I was lamenting how hard it is to find some of the villagers sometimes, but it turns out Nox can do it. Presumably as long as I know the person, which I've met everybody. Tremendous. Oh, a cutscene. Oh. Oh, is this maybe where I get the ability to fish? Oh, a new shipmate. Hi. Have you ever tried your hand at fishing? Uh, no. Apparently not. Ha! No surprise there. I don't think the capital is an island, I would imagine. Hmm. There's a reason all ye capital folks buy your fish from us, right? Do we? Well, take this as a welcome gift from me. Okay. You need a good fishing rod and a proper lure to start fishing. Is that what you just gave me? Come to me shop if you need more supplies. There it is. Whoa. <laughs> Don't get a good look at that fish very often. Now, you'll have to excuse me. I've got fish to catch. Tremendous. Fishing. Basic fishing rod acquired. Tremendous. Uh, It's not one of my main tools. So, do I have to find a particular fishing spot? Beach fishing spot. Requires advanced fishing rod and hyperworm. Okay. Cool. So I guess I do need specific fishing spots. Oh wait, I was gonna find an Amar. Hey, Rainer, how's it going? I'm busy at the moment. What? You're always busy. Let's speak another time. Okay, buddy. Amar, how's it going? Amar trying his best to do good. Move away. <laughs> All right. Uh, Liano, how you doing? Even though I was a stern seafarer in the past, my love of this island is real. Okay. Uh, I feel like they don't, they don't, their friendship isn't high enough. <laughs> who do I, who am I, who am I better friends with? Can I actually find out? Oh, I sure can. I think it's gonna be Derek, maybe. Kips. Oh, Liano is romanceable? Crazy. M B Mateo is romanceable? Oh, I don't know about that. I wanted to befriend him out of spite, but I don't know if I'm willing to go that far. Ciao. How many, who, where, who, who are they all? It's... Uh, Liano, Martha, Mateo, uh, Rainer, Rue, and Xiao. Yeah, okay. So six. Cool. All right, let's go find Derek. <laughs> Since apparently Derek and I are going to be best buds. Where you at, my dude?
could Derek be at Derek's house? Probably not. Hi, Kips. Oh, Derek is it? Oh, no, it's Dean. Hi, Dean. <laughs> what? Do you have anything to report? Where's your brother? Knox, where's Derek? Oh, dang it. Did Knox? Find Derek. <laughs> Incredible. Wait, slow down, my dude. Okay, he does wait for me at least. I love this. Ah, is he in the police station? I guess I can't be terribly surprised. Oh, a cutscene. I'm looking for Derek, not Osman, but whatever. Hi, Osman. Oh, hey, it's you. Yeah, it's me. Got a moment? I guess so. Well, we've decided we need some assistance tidying this place up. Like, literally? Like, cleaning? Or the criminal element? So, I'm looking to take some help on. Okay. You see that board over there? I sure do. You can sign yourself up there if you want to start helping out. Helping us out. Don't worry. We'll pay you for your efforts. Nice. I will. Derek, how's it going, my dude? Stay out of my way, and you'll be fine. <laughs> Good talk, buddy. You want some moon clovers? You giving me this? Well, uh, thanks. Oh, so close. All right. Tomorrow, Derek. Tomorrow. Maybe. <laughs> Do you want to help sort goods at the police department? Uh, part of our time works takes two hours. Uh, it'll be a little late after that, but whatever. Sure. Part-time sorting goods. This specific minigame can be played while you're doing part-time work at the police department. The objective of the minigame is to sort goods into their categories in the time given. You won't get any points if you put goods in the wrong category. How do I do that? Uh, oh. I see. Just whoop, just move him to the, oh gosh, okay. Oh no! I'll get better at this. Nice. 10 seconds left. 125 gold, okay, cool. Yeah, I mean like, look, if just every day you make a little, uh, make a little run around the places you can do part-time work, you'll make a little bit of cash. That's what I'm not gonna complain about. Hello horse, how are you? Doesn't say much, but he's a good guy, that horse. Okay, it is now 20 o'clock. So, did I ever talk to Martha today? I don't think I did. I don't think I ever found her. I got busy. Hi, Osmond. Oh, Martha, hi. <laughs> Let me know if you need any help around the town. Uh, Especially if you need directions. I got lost a lot when I first arrived. Thanks. All right, yeah. I was I was wondering if we were gonna see like notably different text in our conversations, but I don't know. We'll see. There's still time. How's it going, Osman? I don't know if we've really talked. <laughs> As a law enforcer, I'm required to be strict and disciplined at all times. There will never be an excuse for me to slack off. Yeah, that's why you're chief, I guess, and Derek isn't. Or Dean rather. Derek seems like he's kinda good at his job. Dean less so. All right, well, I don't have any moon clovers yet, or left, rather. I do like Cassandra. Cassandra is a diligent and hardworking woman who spends her days assisting her friend Olive to run Moonbury's bathhouse. She's married to Osman, uh, Moonbury's chief of police. Oh, no, kidding. I think I did know that. I love how Dev and Dan are different characters on this, and they actually have different, <laughs> different, like, friendship levels. Uh, Forest, Hannah... I like Helene. I feel like I want to try to foster a relationship with Helene. She's cool. And she runs the arcade. How cool is that? Let's go see if I can find her. At least get our conversation in for the day. Olive's cool too. Do you like tea? I'm just asking. It's not an invitation. Okay. 
<laughs> well, if you keep asking, we're gonna end up being friends. Oh, whoa. Hi, Opal Heart. Hi, Yam. I hope you keep your tools sharp or something. Be grateful that your ax is getting blunt. Whoa. It means you're using it right. Fair enough. Good to know. What's up, Helene? So, you're from the capital. What? We've spoken so many times. I hear there's an abundance of artifacts in the museum. Is that true? The capital museum? Uh, sure, I assume so. <laughs> I've never been. <laughs> Don't ask me. Good night, Martha. <laughs> Why are you upset, Opal Heart? I wasn't even in your way. Was Martha in your way? Good night, dog. All right, let's hit the hay. Sleep. It's Wednesday, my dudes. Let's go. Oh, still no sick people. I mean, oh, cutscene. Do we get do we get a cutscene if we don't get sick people? Wait, what? You're 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 commissioning my dog? Ah, <laughs> good boy. What were you in you in intruding? Hello, Yam. I was on a walk and stumbled upon Knox here. Did you see what he just did he did just now? Profiled someone? Yeah, I did. He's getting smarter, isn't that right, Knox? Keep it up, Yam. The closer you grow to your loyal companion, the smarter he'll get. Uh Maybe one day, he'll be joining my unit as a guard dog. <laughs> well, I'll see you both around. Nox is a potion dog. We'll play again next year time, you hear me? I'm not entirely sure what he did just do. But whatever. Good boy, I guess. <laughs> Some pet pets are in order, I suppose. Here you go, buddy. <laughs> roll, roll, pet, pet. Nice. Um, all right, but befriend villagers. Derek, where are you at, buddy? It's very early. <laughs> Derek is probably in bed. That was Cassandra. Cassandra's cool. Hi, Cassandra. Have you tried the baths at the Willow Waters bathhouse lately? Never. They have a new jasmine soap. Okay. Good to know. Whoop. Uh, let's go to Derek's house. Derek might be up and about already. Maybe he's already at work. Maybe he's that good at his job. No, he's out working. What's up, Derek? Stay out of my way, and you'll be fine. Okay. Nailed it! Alright. Cutscene time, Derek. You and me. I don't know where it'll be. I don't know when it'll be. But it'll be somewhere. Maybe at the police station. Let's go find out. Again, I don't know if the person has to be present. <laughs> oh, hi, Helene. How are you? So, you're from the capital. Yep. I hear there's an abundance of artifacts in the museum. Is that true? I suppose so. We did just speak about that, but yeah. <laughs> Door's locked. What kind of police station is this? Crime doesn't take a nap. What am I doing? Let's go find some more people, I suppose. What's up, Bubble Heart? <laughs> Be grateful that your axe is getting blunt. It means you're using it right. Cool. All right, can I fish here? I can. Fishing mini game. You can acquire different types of fish at each fishing spot. To catch fish, cast your bait and move it towards the rippling water to attract them. An exclamation mark will appear when you have a bite. When you have a bite, the fish will fight against you. You need to maintain your grip when the fish fights back until you finally catch them. All right, no clear indication. Whoa. <laughs> On what mechanically what to do. Okay. Oh, I see. I got it. 
Okay. So I reel, and then when they get tired, do plenty of reeling. But then theoretically, I don't want to. I don't want to get let them let them get too far. But I'm looking at the line, and it starts to get more red. So I'm kind of just sort of keep an eye on that. And there we go. A sardine new record. Is it white meat? Wait, what? Oh, white meat, fresh meat with a fishy smell. Smells better with a squeeze of lemon. Okay, nice. I assume he uh, Knox will be significantly more into that than mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> this is a drum fish. A lot of sort of boom, boom, boom. Crayfish! Neat. Oh, more white meat. Okay, cool. Well, that is very, very straightforward. And it looks like a good way to get some tasty snacks. Probably for Knox. Maybe for me. Uh, but yeah. Good, good to know. And let's go to the ship. Oh, hi. Hey, Em, how you doing? Uh, let's go to the ship or the... Uh, does it have a name? <laughs> it must. What's this place called? They all have fun, fun names. Primrose Sail. That's right. What do you got? Worms. Five gold. Okay, that's not terrible. Super worms and hyper worms. All right, let me buy maybe like 10 worms, just so I've got a nice little supply of worms. And then this needed advanced fishing rod, okay. So, get buying some hyper worms would not be enough. Hi, Hannah. Oh, hi, sugar. Hope you're having a good day. Thanks, I guess. <laughs> The way that I delivered that line made it seem like you didn't mean it, but that's mainly on me. Uh, I'm, st I'm trying to find... I'm trying to find the cutscene, I guess. Oh, let's also do some uh, part-time work. Nope. <laughs> oh, wait. I'll oh, close on Wednesdays now. Boo. There should be more evidence that it won't work. Like, there's, it should have like a closed sign on it or something. Um, okay, to the police station, just in case we get a Derek cutscene in here. Bye, Dean. We don't, tremendous, but Derek isn't technically here. Oh, cool. Knox, I have something for you, my friend. Nope. Nope. Knox, come here. Here, have some food. Have some white meat. I'm sure you're going to like this much more than all the other things I've given you. Uh, well, or not. <laughs> not a fan of fish, Knox? I don't have to tell you. What else is down here? I haven't explored this way very much. Can I go to the train tracks? I assume I can. Oh, and there's a whole train here. Is the train always here? I don't know. I don't know. Interesting. All right, well, that's there. Maybe we should also visit Mateo. Ask him how his, uh, his business is going. How's this working out for you, Mateo? With me being the primary caregiver of all health-related issues here in town. Hi. You should get going. I have nothing more to discuss with you. But I have more to discuss with you, Mateo. We will be friends. Even if I have to force you to be my friend. Which I do, and I will. Who's in here? Horses house. No one's home. 
<laughs> Why would they be? They're probably up here, so. Hi, forest. It's not only raw materials that grow in the wild. You can find some edible items as well. Like mushrooms. Better better know for sure whether or not uh those are edible. Huh? What is this? Item meadow range. Oh. Oh, I can just buy these? Oh, interesting. In a, in a in a in an emergency, I suppose that'll be really nice. Hi, Bubble. Try to avoid leaving the town at night. There are many wild animals lurking around after dark. Yeah. Which really makes me want to try it. <laughs> There's a ton of like items, right? Because like when you look at a potion. There's a lot of a lot of those items are obscured. <laughs> um okay. Trying to make friends. Cassandra's doing well. Derek, yeah, I gotta get that Derek cutscene going. How am I gonna find that? How am I gonna figure that out? I got lucky with uh out. <laughs> Come along, dog. But yeah, he doesn't seem to be in any of these places. So let's uh, let's see if we can't find him again. Find Derek again. <laughs> Good boy. Oh, hi, Derek. Good boy. <laughs> Yeah, stay out of my way. Okay. Dang it. That's not a cutscene, Derek. I'm not gonna lie. Hello, Yam. Lovely day, isn't it? It is. Aren't the flowers simply gorgeous? Have you grown flowers before? I sure haven't. What's up, Yorn? Uh, why are you looking at me like that? What? <laughs> Just, uh, just, just saying hi. Derek. What are we gonna do about this no cutscene thing, Derek? How are we gonna solve this problem? Let's talk. Okay. Hey, Em. I hope you keep your tool shop every day. I will. Rune and heart. How are you? Hey, chemist. Your axe is looking dull. Take better care of it, will you? What? Opalheart says that's a good thing. I'm trying. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's fish a little bit more. Whoa. <laughs> what? Oh. Okay. Oh, I, I, whoa, I snapped my rod. Whoops. <laughs> I didn't, uh, that was hard to, I couldn't quite see what I had. I didn't even realize I had anything uh, hooked. Yeah, pull now. Wow, this thing is got a lot of fight in it. Better be something exciting. <laughs> I don't know why, but it seems like it's always Runeheart that has all the really interesting... Uh, oh, it's an eel. Hello, three pounds. No wonder it was had a lot of fight in it. Uh, Runeheart always seems to have the coolest little things. She sleeps on the bench. She's feeding ducks. Everyone else just sits around and eats sandwiches. Anyhow. Oh, the... Dang it, I forgot to do the police station job. I think that's probably too late. Hi, Meyer. Hi, Olive. Don't forget to visit the bathhouse sometime. I will. Won't. I'll, I'll try. Oh, I still can help. Nice. All right, sort 20 bo bottles of ink. I will. Go!
Ah! Ah! <laughs> One of these days I'll do a perfect job. But it's not today. <laughs> but it is still a new record! Amazing! Wait, what? Did it say 20 out of 100? Anyway, now it's late. Oh, hi, buddy! How are you doing? I didn't know you spending any time over here. Oh, wait, nighttime. Let's go out here and see if there's monsters. <laughs> I don't have access to my axe right here, so I don't think there's gonna be monsters here. Or animals, I guess. I don't know. But are there different animals out and about during the nighttime? Well, so far not. It doesn't seem so. All right, well. I'm a little disappointed. <laughs> I was expecting like big scary monsters, wolves, and the like. But no, just, just slimes as usual. Not gonna complain about more stick jelly. Can I chop this down? I can. Just gonna take up a lot of my energy. That's okay. I'm not gonna be out here for long anyway. Cool. Oh, tasteless sap. And I got a lot more wood out of that. Okay, that's probably another reason to get uh my the axe upgraded, right? Um let's see if we can't real quick if I can find one. Let's see if I can do the same thing with one of those slightly fancier rocks. I can always fast travel. Which is really nice. Um, oh, come on. Leave me alone. Wow. Okay. I don't even know if these little dudes are aggressive, but I'm going to assume they are. Yeah, wow. Cool. All right, let's bounce. <laughs> it's getting very late. Hi, Osman. You can play with uh, Nox if you want to. It's midnight. We gotta go to bed. I don't know how late you can stay up, but I assume it's not not long after this. Okay, let's go to sleep. It is now Thursday. Oh, it still is Thursday because I went to bed on Thursday technically. <laughs> All right, I think it's gonna have to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for joining me. I had a blast uh, Next time in potion permit. We will uh, Hopefully be friends some more people figure out see if we can figure out the cutscene for Derek and Maybe find someone else who can get to level two. Thank you so much for joining me I can't wait to see you all again. Have a great one till next time. Bye Thank you again for watching the video. If you'd like to see more from me, feel free to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell if you want to be notified when my videos go live. I'd also very much love to hear from you down in the comments below.